So I was asked a question the other day and I wanted to discuss it with you. There was a company who had made a provision several years ago for 10 million. So they'd made a, a liability that recognized perfectly correctly at the time a provision of 10 million. Now let's put aside for a moment the concept of discounting. In the current accounting period, they had settled that liability. They had paid 2 million in order to extinguish the liability. And how is that therefore going to be accounted for in the current accounting period? Now, one thing that I want to just talk about is ISA 8. Whether or not this is a, a change in accounting policy, whether or not this is a prior period adjustment, and it isn't. What it is, is a change of an accounting estimate. We had estimated the liability was going to be 10 million and we found that we paid it for only two. So it is to be dealt with on a prospective basis under ISA 8. Now, the double entry, if you like that sort of thing, is credit cash and debit liability. So there isn't an expense of 2 million this year because the expense was recognized three years ago when we established the provision. And the 2 million payment is extinguishing a liability of 10 million. So we're richer, we're better off. There's actually a positive impact on profit in the current accounting period. We credit cash two, we remove the whole liability of 10, so we're debiting the liability by 10, and we've got a spare credit of eight. That's a profit, and that will go in the current year's P&L. So there you go. That's the appropriate accounting treatment when we settle a provision for less than we originally thought it was. Now, you could, if you wanted to, begin to worry about the fact that why did they overestimate it at 10? Were they big bath accounting? Were they profit smoothing? Were they... Uh, being irresponsible in making that provision of 10 three years ago? And were they just thinking they wanted to boost this year's profits of three? I haven't got enough information really to run with that. But, you know, if your mind is alive, you might be thinking of those things. Thank you very much. Until next time.